What's going on, guys? Welcome back to another edition of the Jericho Report Weekly News Briefing. It is Sunday, March 24, 2013. Going to give you all the links I've stowed over the past week. All kinds of news to tell you about. Uh, first day of spring today, I believe. Is it yesterday or today? I don't know, but if you live in the Midwest, you definitely don't know that. Uh, let's see here. Let me start off with spring snowstorm rocks Rockies in the Midwest. This is from CNN. Yeah, if you're in the Midwest, man. Certainly doesn't feel like spring today. Let's see here. Meteor lights up East Coast and social media. You know, just a day or two after NASA says come out and pray. If there's a large asteroid headed our way, we got another meteor. How many does this make now? I mean, I lost count. Uh, reports were coming in from Florida to New York. Uh, this was on the 23rd, so this was yesterday. I almost posted a video, but I was kind of busy doing some other stuff. I'll put this link from CNN. It's becoming a... Uh, anyone else seeing a pattern here? Let's see. You got another one from CBS Baltimore. NASA flash over the East Coast sky, likely a meteor. Really? Put a link to that. Let's see here. CNN, a long night. Uh, Guanaco Marine Base, three dead in shooting. Uh, you know, we didn't have a false flag event, thankfully, on the 22nd, but we did have some bad news that day, so shooting on a Marine Base. Um, we also got, I believe this happened the day before. This was March 21st. The baby that was fatally shot in the stroller. I think they said they got a couple people in custody this morning on CNN. Man, if this story is as the official story's told, there's, I just have no words, man. These guys walk up and just shoot this lady's baby in the head. Sadly, I'm sure it'll be used to push the uh, anti-gun agenda. I mean, I don't mean any disrespect to um, the family in saying that, though. I mean, it's it's freaking tragedy, and I don't... Anyway, let's uh, let's move on. we got another strange story here. Authorities, Colorado prison chief shot dead. This has been all over the media. I'm not sure what's all up with this. I'll put a link to it. Uh, let's see. Police say student planned attack at UFC campus before killing himself. I think this is a false flag event gone wrong. I think something was supposed to blow up in Florida, but it didn't. Uh, strange story there. I'll put a link to that. You got A lot of you guys are already following that. Uh, let's see. Uh, sheriff's refusal to enforce gun rules within letter of the law. This is from the Denver Post. Shout out to another sheriff refusing to uh, enforce. You know, right on. Am I anti-government? Well, I'll tell you what. I'll stand with that sheriff. Take that however you want. DHS question over decision to let Saudi passengers skip normal passport controls. Hmm? Put a link to it. And let's see. Fake pilot gets into U.S. Airways cockpit. Wonderful. And right after that, I'll put this FAA to close 149 air traffic control towers under cuts. Cuts, cuts, everywhere cuts. But Obama has enough money to go uh, golfing with Tiger Woods. Let's see here, and if you're out in California, contamination warning posted in Imperial Beach. This is from Fox 5 San Diego. Contamination warning, be advised. Um, let me see here, what else we got? Those up. Uh, over to uh, financial news. Wow, a lot going on in financial news. It begins, unrest hits Cyprus, police scuffle with protesters. Well, the police that want to... Uh, Guard the banksters. I mean, I understand that they're trying to keep keep civil. You know, at some well, you know, we we've, we've all been talking about it forever. So, it is what it is. I'll put a link from the blaze. You know, you're only going to push people so far, and then people aren't going to be pushed anymore. You got an article from RT Cyprus. Uh, Cyprus to agree on 20% tax on deposits over $100,000. So if you had $100,000 in the bank, uh, I guess you only have $80,000 now. Straight up robbery. Robbery. You think that's not going to happen in America? Let me give you some more uh, links. Now, I got something I think that disputes that. Uh, another official says Cyprus did not reach a deal. I don't know. Deal or no deal. This, those people are straight out being robbed. I'll put a link to that. And from the Business Insider, only Jesus can save the Eurozone. It says Deutsche Bank. I believe that's how you say it. Only Jesus can save the Eurozone. It says the bank. Wow. 
After that, we'll put this. Uh, this is from Google Translate, so I'm not sure if this is going to come up for everybody, but I'll, I'll put the link that I have. Top Economist warns of since. Top Economist warns of since bank run in Europe. They're starting to warn of bank runs in Europe. Don't think that that that. Boy, I'm telling you, if you got your life savings in the bank, you might want to. I'm not a financial advisor, so whatever. Russian leader warns, get money out of Western banks now. I guess this is Putin that's saying this. I'll put a link to this. Again, I'm not a financial advisor. I'm just giving you these stories. U.S. Senate approves proposed internet sales tax. Oh, prepare to pay sales tax on online. That's one thing I liked about shopping online is, you you know, you get, you know, buy something on eBay and there's no, you know what I mean? Well, I guess they're going to be taxing that sometime soon. Uh, and list of school programs to be closed. I believe this is in Chicago. Chicago Public Schools closing 54 school programs and 61 school buildings. That's a great idea, Rahm Emanuel. And the most, one of the most dangerous cities in America. Let's cut a bunch of school programs and give kids nowhere else to go. That's really going to help the crime problem. Epic job you're doing up there, Rahm Emanuel. Just epic. I got one more link here in financial news. Big Put Trade rocks FX Mart. I don't know a lot about when it comes to put options. I do know the put options that were placed right before 9-11, though. So you guys that watch the markets, pay attention to this link here. Uh, and I got this one from F-Town. Big Put Trade rocks FX Market. Somebody's betting that uh, something's going to fall hard. I'll put a link to it. it. Is what it is. Over to New World Order and Police State News. Assault weapons ban out of Democrats gun control. Oh, Frankenstein looks all upset. But, you know, we all know that's not over yet. So I'll put a link to that. From the Daily Caller, New York State offers $500 reward for reporting gun owners. God bless America. Family's home raided over Facebook photo of child holding a rifle. Ridiculous. Uh, police departments beg and barter for ammo while DHS buys up 1.6 billion rounds in the past year. DHS now has enough ammo, you guys know this, enough ammunition stored to fight a 30-year intense war. But yeah, that's all being done for, that's all being bought for target practice, they say. A uh, new drone could snatch humans off the street. Interesting right up here. Why not? And from the examiner.com, Army officer, Obama's DHS intends to kill you and me. I haven't really read through it, but it says Army officer, examiner.com. It's amazing. It's it's amazing to sit here. It's amazing and it's tragic at the same time to sit here and watch all of the stuff that we've been talking about for the past few years. It's it's all playing out. I mean, how crazy are are the crazy people looking now? I'm reading you main mainstream news. I'm not reading you conspiracy websites. Let's see here. World War III news. I don't really have any World War III news. I'm going to send that over to F-Town. Uh, check out Endgame beginning with WW3 for all your Mideast and uh, World War III news. He does just a great job. He's also doing daily videos on his YouTube channel. Put a link to that. And uh, F-Town, the shirt came in, by the way. I just got to go pick it up. Thank you, man. Uh, it's awesome. And a thank you to uh, Joanna McGrath for uh, for donating that shirt to me. That's 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 awesome. I got a free T-shirt. Uh, and I'm honored to have my YouTube channel name on the back of that T-shirt. These shirts will be uh, selling soon. Um, that information will be uh, more to follow. Uh, let's see here. Give me one second. Get things organized. Sorry, this report's so long. I just got a, just a crap ton of links. Uh, <clears throat> but you guys seem to like the longer reports, so you know, I'll do it if you guys want to hear it. It was like a bomb went off. Tornado tears up towns. This, I believe this is in, uh, is this Canada? It's a small write-up here about a tornado that tore up some towns. I believe it was in Canada. Put a link to this. This is 2012 in our changes news, by the way. Mysterious element killing uh, marine life off the East Coast. Uh, let's see. More, uh, more kill going on. I'll put a link to that. I haven't really read into it. 
Uh, and one more from uh, new uh, from uh, or changes in 2012 news. Watch huge crack forming on the Navajo Nation. Unexplained huge crack. Another huge crack in the earth. Crustal displacement. That's always my theory. Every time I see one of these cracks pop up, been a lot of that kind of stuff for the past few years. Uh, let's see where 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 are we now? Strange and bizarre news now. The Bible. Did you guys see this new? Uh, there's this new series on I guess the History Channel or. One of the Discovery channels. The, uh, the 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 character that's playing the uh, the devil in the uh, TV series The Bible looks like Obama. Now I'll, you can pull it up and take a look at the picture. Eerie. They say that they had no intention of doing that. That just freakishly freakishly happened that way. Interesting though. A message, a divine message, maybe. I don't. I don't know. You guys can read into that. Canadian prisoners captured after daring helicopter escape. Man, these guys went all James Bond. Try to use a helicopter to escape from prison. What movie was that? Was that Superman 1, 2, or 3? Where he was... They had a helicopter? Well, they got caught, so right on. And one more from the strange and bizarre bin. Air Force drone found floating on... Floating in the Florida Keys. Man, I was in the Keys. I didn't see no drones. Man, well, how could I have seen that? Anyway, here, uh, Air Force drone found floating in the Florida Keys. Well, you do have a big naval base down there, so maybe there was some testing going on. I don't know. This is from the Huffington Post, I'll put it. That's all I got for news. Check my favorites. I'll put a link to my favorites. I'm constantly favoriting videos. There's fresh news over there, important stuff. You want to check that out. Thank you to everybody who puts out content. Uh, what else? Uh, Shout-outs. Shout-out to, uh, not really a shout-out, but more of a sad... Uh, goodbye to Blog TV. They're closing their doors here in just a couple days. I did a video on my backup channel, So Long Blog TV. And if you're one who uh, watches my live feeds, you want to pull up that video. It's got all of the links below where you can find me over on Ustream. And a big shout out. This week's video is being filmed with the Hero 3 from GoPro, uh, the Black Edition. Big shout out to GoPro. You know, I entered to win the daily contest and I won. They sent me a $1,000 camera package. I am just so grateful because, as a lot of you know, I screwed up my webcam by pointing a laser at it. The lens was not dirty. It just, I burned it. I'm a moron sometimes. And don't point lasers into your webcam. It's no good. Anyway, uh, GoPro Hero 3 Black Edition, amazing little camera. I'm going to put a link to uh, GoPro's website. If you want to enter to win, you have to enter once a day. Um, they pick a daily winner. Um, once a day, they give away everything they make. So I'll put a link to their site. You can click the Daily Giveaway tab on the uh, right side of the page. I'll also put a link to their Facebook page. They announce the winners there. They will also email you if you don't have a Facebook account. Don't worry. So big shout-out to them. Um, that's all I got, guys. If you like this report, please rate it. Thumbs up or thumbs down. If you think it sucks, it's the worst of YouTube. Never want to see it again. Just please rate it. I appreciate it. You can also follow me on Google+, Twitter, Facebook, all that crap, all those links below. Um, that's all I got. Another just week of madness. I got three screens here full of madness. Wow, uh, you know, keep your eye open for incoming meteors, and we still got this so-called uh, asteroid that may hit the Earth in less than seven days or some nonsense. I don't know. I take it with a grain of salt, but it is amazing that just a couple days after that came out, we got this meteor that's seen from Florida all the way to New York. Uh, interesting times. You guys take care, stay safe. I will see you on the next one.